What up guys, welcome back to the channel Dr. Applesauce 2. This is gonna be a super impromptu video. I did not expect this to happen. I'm at my Walmart and they haven't carried Pokemon cards for the longest time. I'm buying diapers and stuff for my dog. So we're gonna do an impromptu Pokemon card hunting video. I'm gonna buy some stuff and then we're gonna go back and open it up. Today's video is sponsored by Invasion Toys. Invasion Toys is a great place to find all of your favorite collectibles and trading cards. Make sure to download the Invasion Toys app for push notifications on restocks of the season's hottest items. And use code APPLESAUCE when you check out to save 10% on your order of $20 or more. Believe it or not, this store has not carried Pokemon in forever. Look, we've got the Kanto First Partners pack, which I don't have. That uh, Reshiram and Charizard GX pack which I don't have either. Here we've got some Fusion Strike. I'm totally not prepared for this. Got some Fusion Strike blisters. If y'all didn't see my Fusion Strike video on how Fusion Strike packs can be weighed, you should definitely check that video out. What do we have here? Countdown to Halloween includes figures, a special finish, and accessories. So it's like a Halloween, a little bit late for that. This got restocked, Turnitus VMAX. Um, I've actually been wanting this because I want the promo. And look at that, it's a little torn right there. So what do we got in here? Chilling Rain, some Evolving Skies, and that Reshiram and Charizard Pokemon card right there. Very cool, we're getting that. We're getting that for sure, let's see. What else do we have? I'm dumbfounded, I was on my way out and looked over and saw the backs of these. Like I looked over and saw this and I was like, oh my gosh, they have Pokemon cards. They haven't had Pokemon cards in forever. And I need this Kanto pack for my 25th anniversary set. We're snagging the Kanto pack. Can you believe it? I cannot believe that my Walmart actually has Pokemon cards. You got the uh, Sword and Shield reprint right here. These Evolution tins are okay. I don't really know if I want them just for the promo. I'm wondering if I should get some of these three pack blisters. If you guys have seen my videos where I've done the blister tests, each blister is supposed to come with something good, like at least one ultra rare or better. So let's see what the promos are. We've got that Eevee promo. Ooh, the Espeon promo is pretty cool. Might have to get one for the Espeon promo. The Eevee promo is okay. They're all like jack up you see how the third pack and all of them is like pushed back the dragonite coin a snag one for the espion promo the whole mess of battle styles some chilling rain chilling rain i was hoping maybe they would have some fusion strike single blisters so i could see if you can actually weigh those because we, we did the booster box weighing and that was intense but i was hoping they'd have some fusion strike blisters but they don't but i think that's gonna wrap it up for all the pokemon that they have i was totally blindsided by this they have not had pokemon here in so long i think we're gonna get uh, a couple of these products we'll go back to the studio and open them up these mystery power cubes are such a scam and see what we can get. All right, guys, that is no joke. This is real life right here. Look, I got uh, doggy diapers for my poor <laughs> old dog, and I had no idea that that Walmart was selling Pokemon cards again. And I'm looking around, because I, I don't even know where my truck is. But uh, I was able to uh, pick up some cool cards. I'm gonna have to put the phone down so I can do the clicky thing with my <laughs> with my dang remote so I can find my truck. Where did I park? Guys, really, like this is, <laughs> welcome to the Dr. Applesauce Pokemon channel. <laughs> Here's the interesting thing. I'm not in my truck today. My wife has my truck. So I'm walking around looking for my truck. But what I need to find is her car, which is right there. This is crazy. Found some cool stuff, guys. Let's get back to the studio. We're gonna open all of this up. What an impromptu, fun little Pokemon card hunting experience. See you there. Alrighty, my friends, we are back here in the studio and I'm <laughs> I'm dumbfounded that we actually found Pokemon cards at that Walmart. That Walmart literally hasn't carried Pokemon cards for years and years and years. So that was real life, real life impromptu Pokemon card hunting that paid off. Guys, as always, it is a beautiful day here in Texas. I hope you guys know that I love you, that God loves you, and that there is an awesome plan for your life. If this is your first time to the channel, I try to bring y'all two to three videos a week on Pokemon. So if you wanna stay up to date and you like Pokemon, hit that subscription button. All right, so without wasting any time, let's take a look at what we got. We scored a couple cool, a couple cool things. So the first thing that we got, and I know I said I probably wasn't gonna get any more Fusion Strike, is I got a Fusion Strike blister. Simply because I've done tests in the past with multiple other videos showing that every time you get a three pack blister you get at least one really good card and so we should get a good card out of this blister maybe it'll be an alt art but also i really like that espion promo right there so that's why i got it and they also had the kanto first 
partner pack, which I do not have. I haven't been able to find this one. Ironically, I saw it earlier in the day at a local game store for 20 bucks and I didn't pull the trigger. And the next place I went to was Walmart where I wasn't expecting them to have Pokemon cards and they had it and I was super glad that, uh, that I waited for that. So that was pretty awesome. Guys, drop me a comment down below. Have you been seeing Pokemon restocks at stores that you didn't expect or that you haven't seen for a while? Stores are getting Pokemon cards more and they're holding on to their inventory a little bit more. It's very, very exciting. And the last Pokemon product that I got is one that I'm super excited about. I could not believe they had it. And that is the Reshiram and Charizard Tag Team GX Collection Box with the gold promos. The whole reason I want this is I really wanted this. And when I checked out on the, I hadn't really paid attention to what all was in here. I just saw this and I was like, cool, five packs and some promos. When I checked out, it was $55 at Walmart. And I was like, hold up, that can't be right. There's gotta be something wrong here. But then I looked and I was like, oh, okay. We have one, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have 10 booster packs plus the promos. 55 bucks makes a lot of sense. So guys, we're just gonna have some fun. We're gonna open some cards. We're gonna save this bad boy for last. We're gonna open some Pokemon cards. We're gonna see if we can hit something good. I haven't seen these yet. So let's take a good look at our Kanto first partners and uh, see what packs come in here. Uh, we don't have any celebration. So maybe it comes with the celebrations pack. I, I guess we about to find out, right? And we got Darkness Ablaze and Evolving Skies. That's cool cool but this this is where it's at oh the original base set artwork starters squirtle bulbasaur and charmander i've been needing these and these are the ones that i've been excited about the entire time very very cool really really cool i need to actually go through my binder and see like which i'm missing one i'm missing one of the releases and i can't remember which one it is all right we have darkness ablaze and evolving skies from our first partner pack let's see if the dot can get some pack magic today I haven't been able to pull any, well, womp, womp, womp. We know what's going to be in there. We got a green code card. If you haven't seen my video about Fusion Strike cards being able to be weighed, you should check out that video. Uh, Darkness of Blaze, we'll just go ahead and go to it because, oh, interesting. Well, that's weird. Green code card, but we got a hollow Suicune. Nothing wrong with that. Suicune's pretty sweet. It's not bad at all. Boom, next up we have Evolving Skies. Yeah, I haven't I haven't pulled anything too crazy lately. My Fusion Strike booster box, I didn't get anything really, really insane at all. Evolving Skies, let's see, this should be safe. Okay, so maybe today, maybe today we can break the curse and get Dr. Applesauce a nice pull. One, two, three, burn the Psychic Energy. All right, let's see what we're gonna get today. We've got ourselves a Lombre, Lucky Ice Pop. And like I said, haven't you guys noticed that stores are staying in stock with Pokemon cards a little bit longer. I think gone are the days. We got a Tropius regular rare. I think gone are the days most likely where you can just walk into any store and Pokemon cards are going to be there all day, every day. But if you get there on restock days or the day after, you might get lucky. Probably the last Fusion Strike I'll ever spend money on. Fusion Strike three pack blister. Like I said, the reason I got this was because I have done tests with multiple sets and every test has shown me that these three pack blisters always, 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 or 90% of the time have a nice hit in one of the packs. So there is your fusion strike code that I don't know, maybe might not even work now. Uh, and this cool Espeon promo. So getting the Espeon promo was just a, an extra benefit to, to pick these up. So let's see if out of our three fusion strike packs, if we will actually hit something, uh, I would love to have that alt art Mew, to be honest, or the alt art Gengar. That would be pretty sweet. So we've got a uh, code right there for you guys. All right, let's see. One, two, three, and we're going to burn the water. Oop, darkness energy. You think the darkness is your ally. You merely adopted the darkness. I was born in it, molded by it. Quillfish, Tynamo, Galarian Meowth, Gossiflor, Reprint Pokemon, Clam Pearl, and well, we got a T-Tar. Unfortunately, I think that might be my ultra rare hit from the uh, from the three pack blister. Maybe not, but it may be. But I do not have this Tyranitar and it is uh, looking pretty good, pretty good. Can this be a three pack blister with double hits? Most of the alternate art cards that I got from uh, my Evolving Skies pulls were from three pack blisters, which is actually pretty cool. One, two, three, burn the... Boom, steel energy. So maybe we'll get lucky today. We got a quick ball. 
We got a Sharpedo Heliolisk, Impidimp, Snom, weird, you, I, Snom is just a weird looking Pokemon, Jigglypuff, Durant, Drillbur, and an Inteleon VMAX. So we did get a double hitter. Man, the Inteleon VMAX alternate art is really cool. This double gunner ability is actually a really solid, really, really cool ability. That's pretty cool. Okay, so we got a double hit in our in our Fusion Strike three pack blister. Okay, can we get a triple hit? The fact that Fusion Strike booster boxes can be weighed is the packs inside of them being able to be weighed is pretty bad. So can that be made up with banger three pack blisters? Let's see, let's see, one, two, three, burn the steel energy. And I did not weigh these because I wanted to be surprised. I wanted to be surprised, see if I could get something cool. We got a Turtonator, that actually looks pretty good. Jigglypuff, Durant, can we get three for three? If we get three for three hits, uh, this that'll be the first three pack blister I've ever opened that we got three for three hits. We got a more Petco and a Huntail regular rare. Not bad though, it's Intelling on VMAX. That's pretty cool. I'm not upset at having hit that at all. But my friends, on to the main event. This is what I'm really, really excited about. I kind of am forced to open it. If I can find another one, I will pick up another one to keep it sealed. But uh, you know, it's already ripped, so might as well, uh, might as well open it. If you found one of these, drop me a comment down below and let me know. But these cards are just too beautiful. And the fact that there's 10 whole booster packs, it's pretty good. So 55 bucks at Walmart for two great promos and 10 booster packs is nothing to be upset about. Oh, we got some vivid, oh golly, they stocked this uh, bar. Five of our 10 booster packs are chilling rain. That's lame. Come on, Pokemon. That's a bummer. Look at that. It's textured and everything. That's really cool. I like that. All right, our 10 packs. We got two Chilling Rain, three Chilling Rain, <laughs> two Vivid Voltage, three Evolving Skies, and two more Chilling Rain. All right, there is a code card for anybody who is lucky enough to snag it. We are going to save those. Unfortunately, we got some chilling pain. Guys, chilling pain for real. Drop a comment down below if uh, chilling rain has just been uh, abusive and brutal to you because it has not been good to me, my friends. Chilling rain has netted me six booster boxes with no secret rares. It's been absolutely crazy. So let's see what we can get. One, two, three. We're going to burn the ooh lightning energy and let's see if we got anything cool in here. Now guys, if y'all didn't see my video the other day, I just announced what the 10,000 subscriber giveaway is gonna be. We're gonna be opening up a booster box from every single sword and shield set and we will be giving away, Chilling Pain strikes again. We will be giving away all of the packs. So we will be opening eight booster boxes and three elite trainer boxes. So make sure that you're following on Instagram. Make sure that you're subscribed, all that stuff. The entries are not open yet. Once we hit 10,000 subscribers, we'll open the entry for those prizes. But um, yeah, we're gonna give away 36 spots and every person that wins is going to get one booster pack from every single set. It should be pretty freaking epic. If you haven't seen that video, go check that video out. We got Expedition Uniform, Old Cemetery, Swirlix. I'm gonna be looking forward to it. And just thank you guys for enjoying my videos and watching my videos. Chilling Pain strikes again. And uh, you know, getting us close to 10,000 subscribers. Based a little over a year, it's been like 13, uh, 14 months almost 150 videos and about 10,000 subscribers. Not too, not too bad. All right, one, two, three. Let's burn the fighting energy. Let's see if we can chase or chase. Let's see if we can cancel and end the chilling pain curse. Mareep the sheep cast form, ooh, double cast form and the chilling pain curse lives on. Two more chances, chilling rain. I believe in you chilling rain, I believe that we can cancel and defeat the Chilling Rain curse and pull our first ever alternate art legendary Galarian bird. Burn the psychic energy. Let's get it. I have faith. Speak it into existence and it shall happen. Shup it. Kubfu, Blitzel, Quillfish, Slowpoke, Impact Energy, and Zebstrika. Chilling Pain strikes again. Alrighty. Come on, Chilling Rain. We can do it. Let's break the curse, Chilling Rain. Guys, drop me a comment down below. 
send some positive energy if you think we can break the chilling rain curse one two three i can't be the only person out there that has had just the worst luck with chilling rain which chilling rain has gorgeous cards in it but uh all right here we go breaking the curse today my friends breaking the curse today cast form blitzel and well you know thunderous not really breaking the curse but still pretty <laughs> Okay, let's check out our Vivid Voltage. We're gonna open our Vivid Voltage and then we'll check out that beautiful Charizard and Resha Ram pack. All right, there is a code card for you guys. One, two, three, and we're gonna burn the Darkness Energy. But for real guys, get out there and look for cards. My friend Ali over at Seismic Shock TV uh, does the Pokemon card hunts quite often and uh, he finds cards regularly. Like I said, we, we may be past the time where you can just waltz into a store, League Staff and Aegislash V, all right, all right, all right. We may be past the time where you can just waltz into your local Walmart or your local Target anytime and find just the shelves stacked any day of the week just because the popularity of Pokemon has exploded. But if you know when the restock days are and you can make it by the store on those restock days, you'll probably be able to find something. Every Friday, if I can make it to the store, I'll find at least a couple booster packs or something. Yanma and a Manetric regular. This has been a really bad box, to be honest. We have had one V out of seven packs so far. Kind of terrible. Um, but hey, at least we've got this. So let's get this guy out of there because this is what it's all about and slides out ever so nicely. And would you look at that? That is a cool card. Gold Tag Team GX. Oh man, GXs are gone now. Basically the GX mechanic is getting replaced with the V-Star mechanic. I'm super, super thankful that I was able to uh, to find that randomly restocked that Walmart. Okay, Charizard Reshiram GX box for uh, the sick promo. We're seven packs in and uh, no no real hits. One Aegislash V that I've sadly pulled probably 20 times. So let's see, ooh, that was really bent. One, two, three, off to Evolving Skies. If we're gonna get a hit, this is the set that I want the hit from. We got a Tentacruel, Boldor, Aroma Lady. I want a alternate art Rayquaza. That didn't work. <laughs> we tried. All right, we got two packs left. Two packs left. I saw somebody else in a Facebook group who bought this exact same box and they had one V hit. <laughs> and they were like, well, at least the promo is cool. I gotta agree with them. At least the promo is cool. We got full face guard. Oop, you go over here. Oh, okay, you can go over there too. And just throw the cards everywhere. We got Hypno, we got Vigoroth, Mareep, Drowsy. Can we get our first alternate art from, well, we've got a couple of alternate arts from Evolving Kaiser. Can we get another one? And a wishy-washy. Boy, this is rough. Where are all the hits? Not in, this, not in this box, not in this box. But guys, I'm having fun. That's what it all boils down to with Pokemon cards, right? Not about if you're just getting hits, but are you having fun when you're opening the cards? If you're opening Pokemon cards only to get hits, you're probably not gonna have a lot of fun. We got one, two, three, burn the darkness energy. Guys, if y'all enjoyed the video, smash that subscription button and that notification bell. Stay tuned for the 10,000 subscriber giveaway and join up as a Dr. Applesauce channel member. There's a little join button right there if you wanna support the channel and you get extra perks and cool little emojis and stuff like that. Alrighty, let's see what we're gonna get. We're gonna get Rescue Carrier, Scrafty, Ursarang, Lotad, Emolga, Woobat, Gossiflor, is today my day, is today my day, and wow, wow, 10 packs and one V. That's, <laughs> that's, that's not the best, I'm gonna be honest with you. 10 packs, one V, the, uh, <laughs> this card is awesome, I gotta admit. This card is really, really cool, really, really cool, but uh, believe it or not, the uh, Fusion Strike three pack blister uh, gave me better hit out of the three packs that were in there than the 10 packs out of the Charizard and Reshiram box, but it was a lot of fun. All right, my friends, well, I hope I earned your subscription today. Check out some of these other videos right there. Lots of fun stuff for you to enjoy. If you haven't already, hit that subscription button and that notification bell. Give this video a thumbs up because likes are free and they really do help. And like I always say, find somebody to love and serve today and be the change you want to see in the world. We'll see you next time.